Hi, first graders. We've been talking a lot about two color families, the primary colors, red, blue, and yellow, and the secondary colors, orange, purple, and green. We've also been practicing drawing concentric lines around our hands. Remember, concentric means close and repeating around the same middle. This concentric line going around my hand is following the other lines very closely, but it's not crossing over and it's not touching. You'll start out your three hands the same way that you started out your single hand. By creating concentric lines around your hands using your color family. Here I'm using secondary colors for my markers because my hands are secondary colors, purple, orange, and green. To start out, I want you to draw concentric lines around each hand three times. This way you have a good start, you can take your time and not feel rushed, and you can see how closely your lines are getting to each other. Once you have three lines around each hand, you can continue adding lines, but take your time. I don't want you to rush on this project. This takes time. It takes patience. It takes diligence. That means you need to stick with it. If you get frustrated, take a break, walk away, take a deep breath, and try again. I'm doing this in time lapse, so don't forget, this is not actually how fast I'm working. You do not have to rush on this project, first graders. Do your best. All right, here's the fun part. Notice how my lines and spaces are getting so close together now. I can't go any further, so notice how I'm turning and changing directions. This time I'm going around my entire project with purple because my three hands are so close, they're almost touching. Stop, turn, go around. When you get to the beginning, you'll switch colors and start again. Here's my primary colors example. See how I can't move anymore? Now I need to reverse and go around my yellow hand shape. Stopping here, turning the corner, going around my red hand now. And when you reach the edge of the page, you stop and pick up where you left off. You'll go off your paper and back on your paper, staying close to your other line, but not touching it. Try to make concentric lines and fill your entire page. You might need to take a break. This is a lot of work, first graders. You can alternate your colors or stick with the same color around each of your colored hands. I can't wait to see your finished project.